recording live from the THS Newsroom in Oxford, Ohio. This is THS Daily News. Today is Thursday, February 29th. We're here to bring you to all the latest news, updates, and announcements at THS. I'm Sienna. And I'm Alexa. Now let's dive right into some upcoming events. There will be a Best Buddies meeting today after school in room 316, Mrs. Salmon's room. Prom committee applications are outside of room 319. The first meeting will be tomorrow. That's right, Lex. And coming up on March 15th is the Best Buddies dance. The dance will take place in the cafeteria and the gym from 3.30 to 5 p.m. Admission will be free. We encourage you to bring a box of pasta for the Tops Food Pantry. Hey, Sienna, do you have any idea what next month is? A matter of fact, I do. March is Best Buddies Month. That's right, and to celebrate inclusion, as well as our students with Down Syndrome, we ask that everyone wears their silliest, most mismatched socks tomorrow. Now here's some information for those interested in track. Hey guys, we're still looking for people for track and field. We practice from 3.15 to 5, and there's a wide variety of events to try out, so we hope to see you there. And that's it for news, so let's buzz into sports with Addie. So we had some academic challenge news come in as SWAC awards were given out at the league tournament last night. Julian Danoff was first team all-conference. Victor Lee was second team all-conference. Dale Tillen was honorable mention. And Lydia Bartell earned the sportsmanship award. In addition, Julian Danoff was named SWAC player of the year. Congrats to all of them. Now, here's Evan with an informational video on how to do your taxes. Welcome to Demystifying Taxes, a beginner's guide to filing taxes. Today, it will walk you through the process of filing your taxes, making it less intimidating and more manageable. First things first, let's understand why filing taxes is important. Taxes fund public services like schools, roads, and hospitals, helping our communities thrive. Your taxes are divided into federal, state, and sometimes local taxes. They're calculated based on your income, deduction, and credits. To get started, you can gather your financial documents, including your W-2 form from your employer, any 1099 forms for initial income, and receipts for deductions. Next, choose how you want to file your taxes. You can do it yourself using tax software, hire a professional tax preparer, or file by mail using paper forms. If you're filing online, there are many user-friendly tax software options available. They'll guide you through the process step by step, helping you maximize your deduction credits. When you're filing out your tax return, double check your information to ensure accuracy. Mistakes can delay your refund or result in penalties. Once you've completed your tax return, you'll either owe taxes or be eligible for a refund. If you owe, you'll need to pay back either tax deadline to avoid penalties and interest. If you're eligible for a refund, you can choose to have it directly deposited into your bank account for faster access. Finally, remember to keep copies of your tax documents and records for at least three years in case of an audit. And there you have it. Filing taxes doesn't have to be daunting. With the right tools and knowledge, you can navigate the process with confidence. And that's all we have for you today, Tamawanda. I'm Alexa. And I'm Sienna. Have a great day, THS. We'll see you tomorrow.